What's up guys, Jason Cardamone here. Happy December 5th, 2013. I just want you to know how much I appreciate you. This, that, that's what this entire video is about, is nothing, the only point is to let you know how much I love you and I appreciate you. That's literally it. I, I, I've actually discovered over the past four Decembers here that today actually holds a very special meaning or right around today and, and I'll talk more about that but but I had some cool things happen to me today and um, several things but one of them was that I was on a book club hangout with one of my teams and um, I just want to show you this so it says someone is looking at you today for leadership inspiration and hope will you deliver and I was reading that so slow because I'm trying to read the words backwards on my little screen here um, I have not been living up to my fullest standard and you know something Tony Robbins always talks about is living up to you know the, the quality of your life is determined by the quality of your standards and and I have really high standards in some areas and in some areas I've let them slip now, now, even in some of those areas, they're still above a lot of other people in the world, but they're not to my standard, the best person I know I can be. And that's where I feel this sense, I, I was going to say disappointment, but I'm not, that, that's not entirely it. Because I, you know, I've enjoyed a lot of time freedom, I have earned it, but, but I, I have this restlessness and I really want to reach out and, and I think a piece of it is all you know, summarized in this, someone is looking to me for leadership, inspiration, or hope right now. Will I deliver? And and I have to look back on the past couple months, and I there have been there have been some days where I completely have over delivered. Like that is totally the best Jason Cardamone I can be. And then there's other days where I'm like, man, I could have used a little work this day. I could have done a lot a lot more this day. And um, so here's why today is special. And sorry if it just made a loud noise there with the microphone. Um, there are at least three reasons, but this is a really special time of year. And I don't mean just the holidays and not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about literally December 5th and 4th. So specifically December 5th, because back in 2009, it just so happened a great man by the name of Jim Rohn, in case you don't know what he looks like, he's this guy right over here. He passed away December 5th of 2009, and I, I just respect and appreciate this guy so much. He was the mentor of Tony Robbins back when Tony was in his like late teens, early 20s. Um, this course that I got, this was back in like, oh, where was I living? Back there, so around 2007 somewhere. I remember this was my first, I think it was my first $300 course, or maybe my second one, I can't remember. Um, the Jim Rohn Weekend Leadership Event. And this thing just changed my life. I've been through this a good four to five times or more. Um, you can see some of my notes. I, I remember sitting, I was living in this awesome house that my wife found for us at the time. But here's some of my, I went through a, um, this is a goal setting workshop that he does. And here are 66 goals I wrote down during the workshop. And um, what's really cool is some of this stuff is already completed. Piano, number six, done, check. There's, there's several things in here. Here's some things around a company I was in at the time, which I actually achieved several of those. And then the company shut down, so I couldn't get number 52 here. But um, I'm, I'm not here to, t oh, that's cool. Network marketing team of 100,000 people, number 30. I actually didn't know I was dreaming that big back then, but that's good. I, I, quite, I haven't quite hit that, but I'm well on my way there for that one. 100% um, debt free, number one, check. That's cool. So anyway, I didn't mean to get all reflective there with you guys, I, just, I was kind of reminiscing through this thing. Um, so, so Jim Rohn passed on December 5th of 2009 and on that day, I was launching a big team system, which turned out to be a system that you know grew a team of over 20, one team of over 20,000 people in the coming years after that. And um, 
I launched it on that day, even though we weren't really set to launch till December like 7th or 8th or so. But I, I, I found out that morning what happened with Jim and the news spread really quickly in all the circles I'm in. And I, I, as, as a tribute to his life, I'm like, we're launching the system this day. And I worked my butt off. And by that evening, we had launched the system out to my team. And it was a big, big undertaking I'd been working on for many weeks prior. And so that's why it was a special day in 2009. In 2010, I, I, uh, let's even back up further. Let's go back to December 4th, 2008. So one day before today, I had just, um, I started a little experiment with a company that, that did turn out to be that same company with 20,000 people. Well, it's funny that like a year and one day later, we actually launched a system to the team. And prior to that year, it was like, we had no system at all. There was no training, there was nothing. So for a whole year, we were growing this team and it was like hundred, it was probably a couple thousand people, I think. Um, but then we put a system in place and 20,000 people, you know, and it took us a couple of years, but it just, that's what really fueled our growth as a team. And um, so I joined that company December 4th, 2008, started an experiment and we just signed up all these people across the next couple of weeks. And it was crazy, like literally an accident. And, and it just turned into these amazing things in the coming years. December 5th, 2009, the day Jim Rome passed is the day we launched that system. Um, right, right around that same week, December 7th or 10th, I actually don't have the dates in front of me, of 2010, I was at Tony Robbins' date with Destiny, a big $8,000, big, 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 like the, basically the biggest life-changing event I've been to. It's like a week long or like six days or whatever. You know, the first day or not the first day, the first day is like just an evening. We went from like eight, six or eight at night all the way up to like one or two in the morning. But the next day or two, one of those days, we usually start at like nine or 10, but one of them, I literally went 12 hours straight before we even took lunch. So it like started at nine or 10 in the morning and at nine or 10 at night was the first time I left the room to go get lunch. Lunch at nine or 10 at night. Um, and that may sound horrible to you, but it was a total life changing experience. And, and so anyway, that was 2010. I actually don't know what happened in 2011, but I'm sure something amazing and life-changing happened. And then 2012, literally a year ago, right now at this time, I was creating a video damn near every day for my list. And and here here's my commitment, my pro, you know, I, I remember one of the guys on my shelf talking about, don't make goals, make promises, call them promises, and, and he put this whole promise spin instead of talking about goals. And um, so my promise to myself is that I, right, right now, I'm almost afraid, notice my hesitation there, I'm almost afraid to say I'm gonna do a video every day. That is what I need to be doing and so that's, that is what I'm gonna commit to. What I want to say is that I'm gonna do several videos a week. Now, when I say a video today, or a video a day, what I hope is that you're seeing one every day as a member of my list. What, what it also means on top of that, it really means three videos a day. I want one video going up publicly to gain more traffic, you know, just, just to throw some love out there in the world and attract some people in to join my list where you're at. I want one video a day serving my list, which is even a higher quality video, a pour more love in, um, give more free advice and steps and coaching and everything I can do, you know, show you guys more like screenshots and some things that I'm doing on a daily basis to grow my business. Um, that's number two. And number three is a video every day for my team. And so um, that, that's been my goal for actually uh, a month and a half about. And I, I ha there's only been a literally like two or three days where I actually did all three of those in the same day. And other days, it's been a random video to the list or to the team, you know, for my team, I did like four or five videos just yesterday alone, and I have two or three more to do today still. Um, so maybe all those eight count for eight days of videos to my team, but I, you know, some days I'll double up videos and stuff, but what, what I really want is to be consistent every day and getting you content every day that changes your life because I, I, I truly do appreciate you. It's, 
you know, I, I look back on the history of, of what, um, how often I've reached out to you as a, as a member of my list. And I, I don't, uh, first of all, let me first start with what I've done great. Over the last year, I've done better than I've ever done since 2007 when I started growing lists. Um, and then in 2006 when I started, I didn't even grow a list because I didn't know you were supposed to. I didn't know anything about it. And um, so over these last 12 months, I've probably sent out maybe 100 broadcasts to the list. I honestly don't know, but I could go check my stats, but I know it's right around that, like 80 to 120, I'm gonna guess. Um, but it's not 365. And what was different is that literally one year ago, right at this time, I was going through the most massive transformation of my life and doing videos basically every day. And what it resulted in was doubling my fam, doubling a six figure income. It was incredible. And, th and that's what happened all the first half of 2013. And then, and I haven't told you guys this, over the last like five months or so, maybe four months, I honestly don't know, but the, the, the second part of this year, I don't wanna say half, because it's a little less than that, that our, our income has actually come down a little bit. Not, not down over what it was this time last year, but it's come down over what it was early this year for when I was really cranking videos and everything. And that's okay, we make ridiculous amounts of money right now, because it's not all about money, it's about lifestyle and living with my family. And you know, my wife's been really sick the last more than four or five months. We've been at countless doctor's appointments and emergency rooms and all kinds of stuff. And I was there for everything when she needed me. And that's, you know, years ago, that was always my dream and I'm about to start crying right now. And even when I didn't really appreciate that, I, I thank God for my wife, you know, that I remember there was a day one of my, my kids were sick and the family needed me for something and I was really busy with business stuff. And my wife just brought to my attention that isn't this why you started doing this stuff in the first place so that when we need you, you're there for us? And I was like, yeah, that's exactly why I started this. And, and I'm so appreciative. That was like a couple years ago. And ever since then, you know, um, whenever, whenever the family needs me or, or like I'm a, right after, literally when I turn this camera off in a few minutes, I'm going swimming with my children. And it's like the middle of the afternoon, everybody else in the world is at work right now. And, or at least in the US, everybody else in the world sleeping. <laughs> and uh, they, you know, um, I know, I, I appreciate that kind of luxury and that free time that, that I get. But also, just because I'm doing all this stuff and now I'm training with a, a four-time Olympian as my running coach, which I'm totally pumped about, just because I'm doing all these things on the side of business doesn't mean, oh, I have to just focus on family or just on my fitness and the business, oh, that's a back burner. That's not, I, Jim Rohn, just talking about him, I he, he always said something about one of your greatest challenges throughout your life is going to be balancing everything and, and you're always gonna struggle to find the right balance. Cause you may get all this business momentum where you're working 16, 24 hours a day. I just put in like a 20 plus hour day a few days ago into business and then, but then what about family and health and nutrition and your personal time and spiritual time and everything else, all these other, you know, your, what about your other relationships in life? And so balancing all those out, it's, you're, you're always going to, you know, find it's, it, you're always going to have a struggle finding the right balance with all those things. And some people are overly balanced with their family and they're neglecting their finances and they're living like, like completely poor and their family struggling because they're not focusing enough on business. Other people only focus on business and they're neglecting their family. Unfortunately, that's what I was doing in 2006 and part of 07. And, and over these years, I'm very thankful through all the personal growth. I have a much better balance now. I'm, I, you know, I, I rarely find the perfect balance, but I am always balancing things like the summer times, lots of family, lots of free time and, and fitness and stuff like that. And then right around this time of year, I've always, you, you know, business things have always started happening. I don't know why in December, I don't really care, 
but I am choosing to make this my January 1st. Today, December 5th. I'm choosing to make today my birthday. My, it doesn't matter. What, whatever is a big day to you, you can choose any day to be a big day. I don't know if you knew that or not. You can choose today to do your annual goal setting, even though it's December 5th. And hopefully you'll see this on December 5th. It might be by the 6th by the time I get this on the computer because I really am leaving with my family. I'm not just gonna go to my computer and get this video online like I would normally do. Um, so, and I didn't mean for this to be so long, guys. What, it, what I really wanted to do with this is just tell you how much I love you and let you know I'm really gonna be pouring extra value into you. And, and if you've seen, if you haven't seen the money tree yet, you need, you know, respond to this email, let me know so I can show that to you. Um, it's a video I sent somewhere, a couple, I think the last time I sent it was right around Thanksgiving, so about a week or so ago, seven to 10 days. Um, I, and I've, I've put out some really cool things lately, but I'm gonna get back to just like turning on the camera doing a video. I didn't, I did zero planning for this video besides, you know, looking at this card and, and feeling the inspiration for the, really for days and days now, guys, to be honest. Um, I also want to give credit, and he's probably watching this, one of my, I, I, I'll call him a mentor, a friend, and a, you know, it was a person who started off on one of my teams and, and he's been my sponsor and I sponsored him and, and we've grown this friendship over the years, especially over this last year. And he's recently started a, a 90 day vlog challenge, which, which I've started the exact same thing like four other times, I believe. And every time I've always, you know, I've only gotten so far. Well, I'm, I'm not, I am not committing to a 90 day one right now. I am, I'll tell you what I'm, what I'm doing guys and how this is going to work. So I am committing to you to doing like a video every day, right? I didn't put a number on it yet because when I do this correctly, it's going to be like 365 videos a year that you're getting or 300 or 250 or something, but a lot more than like the 100 or the whatever I've done this year for you guys. I've done tons of other stuff, but I'm talking about just for my list. And um, so part of it's developing consistency. And even if that means I shoot like five or six videos in a row and then I deliver them one day at a time to you, that's fine. Um, part of it is really honing my skills around video and, and so, so let me take you guys back a year ago and we're, we're closing this out, but I want to let you know what I'm doing to create all this behind the scenes. You know, it's no secret. I, I always share everything I do. And so a year ago, what was happening is that on November 16th, I started going through some training that began to change my life. And by November 25th, I had finished the first one module of that training, one course that I had purchased and I just got all pumped up and I started doing a couple videos. And then around the beginning of December, I was gonna clean up some things with the team system for like, it took me a few days. And I'm, I'm serious, right around this time last year, I should go back and look at my broadcast. Right around December 5th last year is when I started promoting and jumping in and, and real, things started really happening. And so why am I telling you all that is that what created that momentum last year was me listening to training every day and then being inspired to create, whether I'm reteaching lessons I learned or I remember one of the videos I did, I listened to like this one or two hour long audio and I took one sentence that was said in the audio and I taught like a 45 minute video on the one sentence. And that's throwing in all the stuff I've learned in this course and all those courses and all those courses on my computer and all the audios and everything. So, so that's really it. What I'm gonna be doing is doing more personal development every day, specifically around training on my computer. Most of my personal development is on my iPod when I'm out running or driving around or whatever. I don't drive that much, but any, it, it's, it's in audio typically. So I'm still doing that, but I'm gonna do more focus around my, my training at my computer. Internet marketing training, leadership training, network marketing, um, all kinds, several personal development related kind of trainings and taking notes. And then th what, what I've noticed is that that gets me inspired to really, you know, not just inspired, but just like, maybe it's inspired, just like called to go do videos. It, it's what happens with me. Um, 
And so I'm just redoing that pattern. So I'm going through additional training. So I'm ramping up what I'm already doing. I've already been reading books every day, listening to audio every day. I'm increasing the amount of that stuff I'm doing and specifically adding in computer training to, to, to those things. And so um, that, that's really it. And, and my, my real goals are to increase three main parts of my, my money tree. And, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, you need to go watch the video and ask me about it. But uh, you know, the trunk of the tree, the traffic, that's the video that goes out to the public, create more traffic. Because what does that do? The trunk feeds the branches of the tree, which is my list. That's what you are. That's why I do a video a day for the branches. And then a video a day for the fruits of my tree, which are my customers, my team, and, and specific videos. You know, So that's like the highest quality. So if, if you like the stuff you're getting on my list, then just imagine the kind of higher quality stuff that I'm doing one-on-one -on -one and with the team. And and, and that's also part of it, is me ramping up even more one-on-one -on -one coaching, which I've actually been doing a lot of in the last month, um, and, and finding the balance of all that stuff. There was a week there where I did like 10 coaching sessions, and that was more than 10 hours that week. It was a lot of time, because um, I really take my time and, and really focused on a, a lot of high-quality coaching. It's probably more like 20 hours that week. I remember one of the sessions alone is three and a half hours. So one coaching session went three and a half hours. So part of that is, you know, and, and why? Because I pour the most time into those that are my customers and my team. I also pour, you know, you on my list are getting higher quality and amounts and greater quantity of what I do than the people out just in the random world of traffic. I still give awesome stuff out to traffic, but I wanna give you even more because you're a valued subscriber of my list and I appreciate you, which is the point of this whole video, and to let you know what's happening and why December 5th isn't so important to me. And part of this was to inspire you to let you know you can create any day to be your most important day. You can start anything. I, I may even throw in um, going through a 30-day course I have from Tony Robbins that I, it, it's really, really powerful stuff. I might throw that on top of what I, with this other stuff I'm doing. Um, I, I have a couple specific things and, and it may t if my day turns out where it's all personal development, internet marketing training, and I don't have enough time for family and other things, that it'll be too imbalanced for me and I and I could go for sprints doing that for weeks and even months at a time but I know that doesn't lead me to fulfillment and happiness and by the way if you don't know this that's part of what your life is supposed to be about see others and yourself with kind eyes what that means you know part of the deeper meaning be happy <laughs> see yourself and others with kind eyes um, so I will be, you know, not just seeing everybody else with kind eyes and giving and giving and giving all my business stuff, but also what, what keeps me happiest is doing these things. So I hear my family yelling at me. It's definitely time to go. Love you guys. We'll see you tomorrow to your ultimate success and God bless guys.